I'm interested in brain development and specifically understanding how cells in the brain are born and focus on specific diseases, especially those that are um, associated with autism and epilepsy, and try and understand why those diseases occur. We're really entirely an organoid lab, so what's an organoid? A brain organoid is a 3D brain-like structure um, that we can make from stem cells, um, and that includes stem cells actually from patients. So we can generate a stem cell from a patient who has like a certain disease, for example, like an epilepsy or autism or whatever disease, and then we can make it into this structure um, that's grown in a laboratory dish that's three-dimensional, that's kind of brain-like. We use these to understand how circuits are formed, how these brain cells interact, um, and how sometimes these circuits can go awry or don't form at all in the case of particular diseases. The brain organoid field in general is, is relatively new. Um, and so part of it really is trying to make more sophisticated and better organoids. So that means how do we get different kinds of cells in there, uh, a greater diversity that better represents what actual brain is. It is a new technology, but I think um, there's a lot of vision in the department and leadership to say, you know, this is somewhat of a gamble, but there's evi enough evidence in the data to suggest there's something important that we can learn from it. And I think that's sort of like really visionary thinking in terms of trying to diversify the program and think about neurological disease and, and neurological research in sort of new and, and innovative ways.